My name is Rachel Burns. I am a disabled veteran that served in the United States Army. And this is my two-year-old Pyrenees Lab mix. Her name is Nova. Nova is a psychiatric service dog who helps mitigate PTSD and anxiety symptoms. Uh, and she also has mobility assistance uh, for stairs. I got Nova almost two years ago and she graduated last year in August. She was so nervous when she started because she was so little, she was, she was really young, but she picked up really fast and she still does because we're still learning tasks and still doing things. She has graduated for public access, but you always wanna be working with your dogs and, and training and trying to push them farther. She is trained to help when uh, I am struggling because of PTSD symptoms like anxiety, with a public situation sometimes. And before I started with Nova and OFD, it was, it was difficult. I was trying to delve into helping other veterans and not really helping myself much. In helping myself, I'm able to help more veterans. That's the hope with OFD is we can help more. I do also have pet dogs at home. I have two of them. Um, there's a big difference. Uh, she'll play with them, but if I'm there and if I'm looking at her, she knows and she'll look over and she just does visual check-ins with me and she can check from 20 feet off easily through a glass door and see if I'm okay or not. There's just so many things you can train them to do and I'm, you can train any dog to do them but there's just something different when you're trained for things that are so crucial to your existence. And she knows that, I think. I think they all know that. I see that in class, like the way that they look at the person that they're with. Is that right, Nova? A lot of our uh, dogs are, are doing things that are somewhat natural. Um, they're sensing uh, heart rate, uh, they, when the, our heart rate rises under stress, um, they can do nightmare detection, they can pull the blankets and the, and the pillows out from under their head just to wake somebody up safely. But the biggest one is the smell the pheromones. When our heart rate rises under stress and what they can smell and what they do in that moment is, is amazing. And they can also look down at that dog in a stressful moment and see that dog's not stressed and it, it kind of feeds back to say, hey, it's okay. I think the dog adds to the peace. Just in a moment where it's chaos, you can look down and, and just kind of center yourself on that dog and that dog right back on you and they just feed off your energy. And that bond is just inseparable as time goes. But just having that partner nearby and unconditional love is, you know, a game changer.